This video shows some interesting collective behaviors on groups of up to 29 kilowatts. This first demonstration starts as a group of robots around a stationary nest robot, which is marked in red. And to the left is a stationary food robot, marked in green. The robots are tasked to reach the food and then return to the nest, simulating the foraging of food. Initially, the robots don't know the location of the green marker, so they start exploring the environment while maintaining a communication link with the nest. Eventually, a connection is made between the nest and the food, and some robots decide to move to the food and then simulate picking up the food by turning on their green light. They next find their way to the nest, where they simulate dropping off the food by turning off their green light. In this follow the leader demonstration, the kilowatt marked in green is the leader, which tries to move forward while at the same time not getting too far away from the following robots. The robots behind the leader try to move closer to the robot in front of it, while at the same time not moving too far from the robot behind it. In this dispersal demonstration, each robot will move randomly if they can communicate with any neighboring robot, and they will stop if they cannot communicate with any robots. Following these simple rules, a swarm of robots can disperse in the environment. In this synchronization experiment, the robots start unsynchronized, but through simple communication, they can eventually become synchronized. 